Okay, so what we have here is a, another item that was actually went into space. Ed, uh, the gloves and the helmet, who, who do they belong to? These were astronaut Buzz Aldrin's extravehicular visor and gloves that he wore on the Apollo 11 mission when he walked on the moon. What you see are the, uh, the gold-plated visor that would protect him from the radiation, uh, from damaging his eyes. Uh, underneath that would be the clear bubble helmet that would have kept him pressurized and kept him alive. Now, right here are his gloves, which are the steel mesh on the palms and to protect the knuckles to keep anything from penetrating as he would you know, have to grab rocks or manipulate tools. The tips are a, a blue rubber silicone to allow a grip. And then finally on the gauntlet portion of the gloves, uh, you can see we have a magnifying glass that shows the astronaut's checklist. I think it's fine cool because obviously you think, you know, uh, when they go up there, they knew you what to do in their head, but actually they had a list of what the, the things they carry out. Absolutely. So you think of an endeavor as complex as, and as dangerous as space travel, everything is planned to an exacting detail. You know, uh, that's what astronauts are paid for, is to do things as perfect as possible to have the best chance of success. Yeah. Uh, down to even the now famous picture of the boot print on the moon, that is on that checklist. And somebody beforehand had thought, I think, well, it'd be cool, let's get a picture of the boot print. Yeah. Because, well, if, you, if you're going shopping, you take a list of what you need. So if you're going to go to the moon, I suppose it makes sense well, to take a checklist as well. Well, think of the amount of national treasure, the danger, and everything involved. Yes, you want to be as thorough as possible.